Now Phil Brown gets it through to Scott Green. Super ball. Well, good ball to John McGinley. McGinley, yes! It's through a 1 0. John McGinley, brilliant pass from Scott Green and a superb goal stuck home by John McGinley. What a fantastic goal there from Bolton Wanderers. A fantastic move. Brilliant pass up the right hand side from Phil Brown. And it was a superb cross in. Straight in from, from Scott Green, straight in front of John, Mink, John McGinley, and didn't he take it like an absolutely world-class striker? Yeah, well. So Patterson plays it forward to McGinley. McGinley is off again, he gets it. Now Andy Walker's in the clear, Andy Walker! Oh! Now David Lee! Oh! Dear me, so nearly 2-0. It would have been 2-0, it should have been 2-0. Well, what a comedy of errors there in the Liverpool defence. Another good ball played through, and John McGinley as live as ever. Sort of hour or so. So, corner kick by Patterson, headed on, it's there, Seagraves, it's there, 2-0, a good corner kick, played across from Mark Patterson, and Seagraves did the rest, what a good goal. Well, I don't think Liverpool have been watching our videos recently, Dave, because if they had been, they'd have known that we are deadly from those, those corner kicks. A lovely floated corner kick in from Mark Patterson, and again, it was a flick on at the near post, didn't quite see who got the flick on. Well, it's so dangerous in those situations, and Mark Seagraves came piling in, and now Liverpool in real trouble, 2-0 down. He's having a word with it. The referee just having a word with the Bolton manager, Bruce Rio, apparently for something he said. But that will not worry, Bruce. Tries to find uh, Andy Walker. Steve Niffle plays it back to Hooper. But Andy Walker, Andy Walker gets it. It's Walker on his own. It's a corner kick. He has the confidence to finish. He has the confidence to score, but he didn't on that occasion. Well, what's this goal he doing altogether? I mean, that was an absolute disastrous mistake from Hooper. Kelly. Kelly finds Walker. Yes, Walker. Oh, oh. It went wide. I think it hit the post. Did that hit the post, but there it is. That's the half-time whistle. But well, haven't they been lucky? So it hurts a bit when it's cold, doesn't it? The ball swung across. Oh, it's good save there by Brannigan. Great save. Superb save. Now McGinley winning it. Now Rosenthal, the ball breaks for Ronnie Rosenthal. Excellent chance here. Yes, it's oh, hey, Oh, an own goal. The ball struck the foot of the post. It came back, and as it came back, it struck the legs of Matt Winstanley and went in. Own goal. Seagraves just being beaten there, Rush, good shot that by Ian Rush, showing his true quality there, great skill there. <laughs> Corner kick taken and played across, Brannigan, fisting it clear. No, it's not, it's uh, Scott Green. Now Kelly, Phil Brown. Good cross. Walker, McGinley, oh! Almost. Andy Walker just let it run through to McGinley there. If McGinley could have only touched it. Now Seagraves, probably man of the match, makes a mistake. Mike Manaman. Mike Manaman. Good save. Oh, it's the who scaly. Uh, I mean, the lucky lot. Club video. Club video radio. Okay. Yeah. Good afternoon, John. And a difficult game. Very difficult. Uh, Probably thought it was all over when we went 2-0 down, but we kept plugging away. Unfortunately, we came back in the second half. What do you think about the conditions? Well, they're not ideal, but I mean, you know, it's, it's uh, January now and you expect conditions like this. We would have liked the pitch to have been a better playing condition, but it wasn't, so we just have to get on with it. What do you think about your own pond? Do you feel that you're on your way to fitness again? Yeah, just make it about 10, 20 degrees hot and I'll be okay. <laughs> okay, all the best. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay. Well, Ronnie, a difficult game, that one. Yeah, definitely. I think uh, after all, we were a little bit lucky today. Uh, after we, uh, you know, we were tunneled down, and we should have conceived, ma considered maybe another two or three goals. It's all odd to when you when you came onto the field, isn't it? Yeah, I think uh, I think that we equalised not especially because I came on I think because all the, the players knew that uh, we played wrongly in the first half and we had to come back and to change things after that uh, bad uh, first half. Well, thank you very much for the interview and uh, hope you do well for the rest of the season. Thank you. Thank you. Good afternoon and a good fight back there by Liverpool.
Yeah, we had it all to do because Bolton caused us many problems in that early, early um, part of the game. The first 45 certainly belonged to them. They got two goals, and I suppose they would say we're unlucky not to get um, maybe another one or two. But I felt in the second half we played a lot better. We matched them. Uh, more than we had done in the first 45 and managed to get a draw out of it. I think it all out to when Ronnie Rosenthal came on, didn't it? Yeah, you would. Um, we got a couple of breaks of the ball just in this area here, yeah. which led to um, us getting the opportunity for Ronnie to be in on goal one against one. We got a break when it came back off the post and, and unfortunately for um, the Bolton player came off him and into the net. That um, Ronnie's a danger because Ronnie will always run forward and he's got pace. But this was a good cup tie today, I think. Um, Bruce will be pleased with his players, with the first half performance they put in, and I'm certainly pleased with my players, the second half performance they put in. It was an exciting cup tie, I'm sure the public enjoyed it, and I think we'll almost look forward to the second game. Yeah, if the second one is half as good, it'll be a cracker, won't it? Well, everybody turned up today, everybody thought yeah. this, this was going to be a cup shock. This, coming to Bolton at any time of year, would always be a difficult game. Coming this time of year when the pitch is less than perfect, um, it was not going to be an easy game for us today. No, but thank you for the interview no, and pleasure. happy New Year. My pleasure and the best thank luck you. to you and Bolton. Thank you very much. For 93. Thank all right. you. All right. Good luck, Jack. Thank you. All right, man. Thank you.